the camera lives For another now. day. <laughs> yeah. I don't even know how. Like, I was messing with it earlier. Couldn't get it. And I was like messing with it without looking at it. It looked back at Sarah and Eve and I looked down and it just like fixed itself. So. We're doing something that we haven't done in a while. Going to the going movies. Going to the movies at Disney Springs. Our so, first non-movie non pass. pass. It's movie. just Christopher Robin. We have to see it. Like, yeah. I don't know how. Literally, like, I feel like the week that Movie Pass blew up was when Christopher Robin came out. Yeah. And that's all. Like, I told her, I was like, that amount of me were like, I want to see those two before our Movie Pass expires. But it is what it is. Life goes on. It's kind of weird to be in here because we haven't been here in so long. <laughs> we're seeing new things that we're like, we haven't even seen this. This is, they didn't get our approval, but we're going in. <laughs> here we go. I had a headache all day long, so we needed, what? I do somewhat, um, but yeah, it'll be nice to just have a relaxing night at the moon. And Disney Springs with chocolate. Journalists. I'm going to be back in here. It does feel so good to be back in here. And you're filming in the movie theater. We're gonna get we'll a let you know how much we cry. You swim the depths of the depths of the stars. Yeah. Okay, we'll let you, you walk know. on top of the window. We know we have a shirt. It was so. You better with the bow. I told you. I didn't cry. I almost thought about it once or twice. I shed a tear or two, but wow. Well, we'll give you a better review in a second. Free dabs is playing. We never see them. Guys, I think you can do better because this is the worst spelling of YMCA I've seen ever. Yeah, now it's time to bring who we need up. Real talk, the grocery store packed with the heat up. Hopefully they will let him do the lead up. Don't crush this kid when you go to do the zebra. Oh, oh. Everybody move! Oh, everybody move! Oh, everybody move! Thank you! Round of applause yes. for the zebra, everybody! Well, of course we walk up right as they were ending, but we still got to see a cool portion. We might come back at 9, 15, or 10, 15 to see a whole set. But that was such a good movie. Go check it out. Go bootleg it. Go buy it. Go see it in theaters. Go see it. Classic like Winnie the Pooh story. Yeah, it was like the hook story for Peter Pan with Christopher Robin. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the awesome so ending. Movie. So. We were laughing so hard. It was funny because when we saw the one of the Zoe Deschanel's the music, you know, it, like it eight like, years ago, Sarah and I like we were laughing the whole time, and this time we were laughing or crying the whole time. So. Now, of course, we need some free honey and Giardelli. We, we need honey because of Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> How about something to eat? What could be more important than a little something to eat? They also have like the honeycomb out the track. Ooh. Is there a rumbly in your tummy? Not to worry, tummy. I always know what to do. A poo bear takes care of his tummy. My favorite is the orange blossom. Which one do you like this? Black sage. Yeah. We tried some of this. We described it as butter, but better. Do you think it tastes like butter? He heard us say it tastes like butter, so we were like, he let us, he let us taste the cinnamon one. I need this cinnamon whipped honey with cinnamon. I need this a lot. Like this, smeared on some Yeah. Bread every day. I would eat this every day for breakfast. Cinnamon, lemon, and chocolate. Just know in, in elementary school from first grade until high school, I ate the same lunch every single day. <laughs> Turkey sandwich with cheese, cool ranch Doritos, Rice Krispies with treat, and a bottle of water every day for like 15 years. So you could do that every I day? I this with honey with cinnamon. I need this in my life with on bread. That'd be my breakfast every day so until I die. When there is no honey, the poo takes the tummy wherever the honey will be. My friends are out there with honey to spare and they will take care of my Tommy and me. You must get 
the Giardelli. So they didn't switch over from Carmel yet, but look what they did put out, which they did not have out before. Stocking stuffers, Christmas ornaments, Giardelli Powell and Hyde Streets. Oh! So. We're now going to the Christmas store because you all know that we are in the season already, watching Christmas movies every night. And uh, I just want to smell it. And we just did some shopping. We're trying to figure out when we're going to let you know what kind of shopping we just did. What? We're visiting. I think it's going to be tonight, but Sarah's going to send a, a text message or something. Um, Sarah clearly doesn't check out the book section when she comes to the store because this was here the last time we were here. Which is classic because it's got your Christmas. I thought we had it already. No. Oh, we need to get that for Michael. My brother's obsessed with Nightmare Before Christmas. He has a sleeve, tattoo sleeve. But I love all the Christmas books and stuff and fluff. It's just so beautiful. Yeah, it's super well done. But we still promise, even if we leave early to go somewhere, we're still going to go to Sugar Boo, right? That's for all the coloring for me. For Christmas? Oh, it's been a while since we've seen this strolling piano player. This is what Sarah wants to do one day. Goodbye. so good and we just got the green light we decided we're going to Katie's Dustin and Eddie's because this bag that we just did shopping is not gonna be a secret because it's Katie's birthday's on Monday right yes and we got her this cute cute skirt that she was eyeing because it has pockets and from pinup couture yeah pinup couture that or something like that something like that that she was looking at at Springs the other day and so we're gonna give it to her early so she can maybe wear it on her actual birthday yeah she's doing another engagement photo shoot I'm curious to know after we give it to her if she was trying to plant that seed or not. <laughs> but we're gonna leave Springs. I promised myself and Sarah promised me too that we would stop by Sugar Boo. So we're gonna skip on over to Sugar Boo and then head out. She's the best. Sugar, 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 uh 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 uh. Yeah, Sugar Boo and Co. Ooh, free cooler with any $20 purchase. Thank you. <laughs> they have to cheat those back. And since it has to be given, traditionally given to friends as a token of goodwill and love, Sarah is, is technically buying it. There it is, the description. Chanchito in the small village of Pamir, Chile, it is believed that Chanchitos look little pigs bring good luck. Three-legged Chanchitos are especially fortunate and traditionally given to friends as a token of goodwill and love. Thank you, Sarah. You're welcome. Dustin's and Eddie's and we're gonna surprise Katie with her birthday present early. I hope the door's unlocked. Nope. It's not. So no. The door Stay back. the door was locked. Stay back. Is she still up? Oh my god, get her. Come on. Come, come on. Come on. We're visiting. What the heck? We want to your birthday early. We want to give you a birthday present just in case you want it what? early. What? What is happening? <laughs> it's your birthday weekend. <gasps> Do, 
We didn't know if you wanted to wear that for your birthday or not. I was worried about the size, so I wanted you guys to have time. So we gave it to you two days early. To return a couple it. days early. <laughs> it has pockets. I knew they were coming. I didn't know. I texted Dustin, but I'm assuming he's just sleeping. <laughs> Do you like your birthday present? I love it. So the third one. I tried it on. Hey, Alexa. Play Park Hopper Podcast. Yeah. Getting the latest episode. Oh, do the twirl again. Oh, it's so cute. Ooh, do you like it? Does it fit right? I think I'm gonna wear it for my engagement shoes. Ooh. Well, because we're getting another shoe on Monday. Yeah. This is not. Alexa, stop. So, because I'm probably gonna do two outfits. Eddie, grab that sweater. These dongs can smell my dong. My dog's been loving on me all day, so I'm extra smelly. How come I've never seen that cute pickup truck pillow before? Sarah, have you seen this before? It's No. Put a comment down below if you love this pillow. Because I do. Oh, it's fall too. It's fall and it's not Halloween. See how it's got the flowers? We're doing a mix. Uh-oh, there's stuffing flying. Uh-oh. What? No, that's probably chunks of Padme. Yeah, it's chunks of Padme. She got groomed? No, no, she's just shedding. She looks fresh. She's, she's, she's shedding, shedding her her summer winter coat. coat. <laughs> it's going into winter. She wouldn't just shed her like, winter she coat. She got her old winter coat taken out, so I don't know what's gonna happen. She's gonna. Take I used to. Off. I had a husky growing up, and I used to love to pick her his uh. You wanna see that funny? Winter coat, yeah. Yeah, you just burnt. Can you see it? That's naughty. She's burnt because she's out in the sun all day now, and she needs to cover up. Wear a shawl. My mom would call it a pashmina. A pashmina. I've never heard that before. Five bucks says I. Five bucks says we stayed way too late, and another five bucks says I fall asleep on this couch together. Go, <laughs> go down memory lane. Hey, Peter. Look at Aurora just being the queen of the castle to all of her toys. <laughs> and let us know if that one. Where's my finger? Wait. There it is. Let us know if that one looks familiar. Squinch. Aurora. Hi. I love all of your toys. Does that feel good? <laughs> <laughs> this is what you, you do. I just like to point out when we came over, Katie was like half asleep on her couch. I was like, what are you doing here? <laughs> and now it's been, I don't even know what time it is. What time is it? My magic yes. band. Uh, 12.30. 12, 20, and 37 seconds. Jeez, I was hoping I was wrong and it was like 10. That was two hours ago. How long have we been asleep? I fell asleep on the couch. He took a trip down memory lane. Again, the dogs just cuddle me. And I can't handle it. So, we gotta go home. I just wanna point out that I think this is new. I think our friend Lauren would absolutely love this. This is the kind of welcome I get back every time I come home from Eve, especially if she's been sleeping. But Sarah's getting ready for bed. I gotta get ready for bed. It's later than I expected. I think we'd be out till one in the morning. But that's what happens. I've been asleep, so I shouldn't complain. Sarah's blown, been awake talking to Katie. So it's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>